Hey everybody, what's up? Turn the light. Yeah, I'll turn off the light. We need to be more. Uh... All right, so I'm gonna end this and go back to the title screen. But basically, we were just doing a test right before this started. Uh, we are playing the um, trial of Resident Evil Seven: the Beginning Hour. Um, we I was planning on getting this uh, at some point. Um, the game has been out for about like two days, I believe. Two, three days. There's a beeping thing. It's my um, battery. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, the game's been out for like two to three days. Um, and yeah, it seems really good. Uh, I've played the trailer a few times. Oh, it's cutscene. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that was a good cutscene. Okay. Oh, no, no it's, it does one of those things where it's like... <laughs> He has, this guy has no disregard for uh, equipment. This guy literally just doesn't care about what's going on. So there's three routes I can take. I can take the norm, the neutral ending, the bad ending, or the the best ending. Which one do you want me to try and do? Do all of them right now. <laughs> yeah, we won't have time for that. No, we got to see them all. I haven't gotten the best ending yet, so I can try and go for that. Yeah. We'll see how that works. Okay. So let's just start by examining with what we find. Uh, I will dash them against the stones. What? Yeah, I thought it's pretty cryptic. Until you realize that you can do this. So depending on how how you play this, say if this was the first time you were playing through the game, you wouldn't think to do that first. So the events play out differently. If you if you watch the tape and then go, because um, you get the tape, but if you grab the fuse and then go and do all the other stuff, um, the ending is different. So, if you had just followed the game without knowing that you could do that little thingy, you would get the, um, I think it's the bad ending, technically. Alright, oh, here it is. Welcome to the family. <laughs> that, that, that's the bad ending, is the welcome to the family ending. Oh, it's beautiful. The graphics for this game look really nice, though. Yeah. Oh, look, it's sunny outside. Yeah, you've been uh, asleep for a while. Hey, let's check and see what's in the fridge. I'm hungry. That's disgusting. All right, I think I lost my appetite. Uh, you want to heat up some mashed potatoes? What is it? It's a dead bird. Oh. That's pretty nice. Well, people eat chicken, so it's okay. That's just a rotten chicken, I guess. <laughs> I forgot you can block. <laughs> All right, hey, let's see. All right, so we got some bolt cutters. What? Yeah. All right. Well, uh, that happened. Um. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. All right. Uh, let's use the bolt cutters. So the events play out differently depending on what you do first. So I'm going to grab the tape but not view it yet, and we're going to go upstairs. Alright, uh, yeah, let's go upstairs. So if you look at the ceiling when I walk upstairs, you see that? Mm -hmm. Dust fell down. So that's pretty interesting. That's interesting. All right, well, they turn towards me, so uh, it's cool, I guess. Let's see what's in here. Hello? Oh, hey, look, there's a mannequin right there. 
Well, let's call some girls over for a house party. Uh, the phone's dead. Now you got some nice <laughs> shoes, too. I do, don't I? I'm like wearing some nice corduroys <coughs> for pants and then uh, some nice loafers and a nice uh, button up shirt. This dude is dressed for success. Alright, uh, so we're gonna take the basement key. And under the bed, there are some handgun shots. So we're gonna. We're gonna take those, and if you look up there, there's your escape, but we need the key for it. Uh, I don't know what this door is for. You can't go in. So, there's that. You can actually push over mannequins, too. Alright, that's not what I intended, but okay. This game looks really beautiful. Did you hear that? Maybe. There's a clicking. Like something unlocked. Alright, so we are going to approach carefully. Let's check what's in here. Have we got a dummy finger? Um, nothing in here yet. Walk around a bit. What's in here? <coughs> More handgun ammo. Oh, nice. <laughs> Bloody bike and the water's still running. That's pretty good. That is absolutely brilliant. Thank you. Dude's uh, water, uh, water bill is going to be incredibly high. That's good, right? Hmm. Guess what? We're going down there. Dum -de -dum 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 -dum. We're not going in there just yet, though. That comes a bit later. We're going to take the screwdriver, right? <coughs> or the lockpick, and we're going to go all the way back up to the kitchen. I just noticed that door closed by itself. And uh, as per every Capcom game, you don't have a reflection of yourself. That means you're soulless. Exactly. Or a vampire. <laughs> or all of the above. You're a soulless vampire. You're a non American. <laughs> Nothing in that drawer. I'm gonna use a lockpick. <coughs> We're gonna get something that's very essential to the plot. An axe. <laughs> huh. <laughs> yeah, you can do stuff like that. And leave holes in the wall. But not break drawers and stuff. Alright, so let's take a look at what's on that video though. It's a very curious thing to see. And uh, if you notice, the TV is now on. So let's go ahead and see what's on that tape. So that's supposed to happen this year. <laughs> what did you find this guy? He's scared. Hey, hey, I only work with professionals. <laughs> Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. Man, Andre looks kind of weird proportionally. Who? Andre, the guy on the left. Just don't be surprised oh. if we have to make a change. New plan. We do a walk through the inside first, then we shoot the intro. Just like we always do. <coughs> Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shit. Happy? I remember when uh, Jeremy and I first saw the trailer for this? All we did was rip on this dude for saying the word fuck like 20 times in a row. 
I don't know, dude. Like, personally, I don't I, think swearing in a horror game, like, well, prof- profusely, is. Oh, well, that's not it. Like, it just feels unnatural. Because, like, I know <coughs> met somebody who literally just says, fucking it, fuck it, fuck, fuck. You know, there's a fucking. Especially, fuck it's also a Resident Evil game. game. And you don't really hear swears other than, like, shit. Or damn. Well, well, you never hear F bomb. That's it. That's flat out. You hear everything else. After and it's weird that you just get used to that. And it's like, huh. Like, it does sound unnatural. So, why are we in hell this time? But, huh. Prep? That's Whoever actually a good prep, question. Why doesn't he ever prep? Ooh, is it haunted? Is he a douchebag? Oh, there we go, he said it again. Weekend sub, peeps. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. How long do you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. Damn. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not Hillbillies, the Baker, <coughs> Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. See what's in the fridge. Ah, shit. Ew. No, I shouldn't wear my good shoes. Oh, what are you stepping? Poopy. Oh, I don't know. Shit. I think you stepped in, uh, yeah, something shot. like that. Not poop, but like. Although. Let's make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? <laughs> he stares off into nothing <laughs> for like 15 seconds. Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Guess what? He drops another one. Where is he? Unfucking believable. <laughs> this is the last time I work with that guy. Boy. I mean, producers, Funny that they you say go, that. but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy? You stick with me. <laughs> Even though he just shit talked you like 20 yeah, seconds ago. Yeah, I know. Ago. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? No, I didn't hear that. It's Andre. He's like naked jerking it. He's like, yeah. <laughs> oh, this would be a great shot. Andre? <laughs> How many is that? Like five now? <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm also very Andre, sick. So. You, man. Well, what happens if I? What the hell? Oh, hey. You gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> that, that's the sixth All thing. Right, deal. Jesus, dude, this guy likes we, to we say the F bomb. We go. A lot. We fuck this show. Or drop the F bomb a lot, Jesus. We gotta, gotta get a nice view of that butt. PS4 buy right there. Is there anything interesting? <coughs> no? Hey, you can make out your shadow at least. Kind of. It's interesting. You first. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, hey, you uh, can kind of see Andre. You first. What do you see? I see what dead people. I do too. Oh, there's Andre. Hey, buddy, how you doing? You doing okay? You look a little, oh my lord. <laughs> so, what was his mouth bashed in? Or his throat slit? I can not Because he had puffy red eyes. And it looked like his mouth was bashed in, but... world may never know. What is it? I shall dash you against the stone. Well, when did that appear? Oh my god. Someone's been watching us the whole time, Jeremy. Did you hear that? What is it? There's another click. 
Real good. Someone's near us. Uh oh, the door behind us closed. Alright, well, um, let's do this, I suppose. promising am I right? Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab that valve and we're gonna Okay, yeah, okay, cool. Okay. Is that a lava? Yeah, that's the dude. Get out of there, get out of there. Ah. Oh my god. That was actually kind of uh, scary. Oh, okay. Do you think I'm coming after you or? Uh, yes and no. Uh, depends on how far away you get. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. Remember that valve right here? Well, you know what we're gonna do? Remember, kids. Mm -hmm. If you eat something bad, it's gonna pass through you. But never, ever try eating a gun. Those are bad. That's a lot of jelly you just flushed. Alright, I got four shots. You gonna kill me? See, that's the thing. I don't know. <laughs> I never picked up the gun before because I never ran out of there fast enough. I look Call of Duty the game. It does look very Call of Duty like, doesn't it? I think it's a first person shooter that looks like that game to me. Alright, well, let's see what happens if I inch my way. I think just back me. <sighs> I'm supposed to aim for the head, I think. Oh, now I just got hit. Oh god. It's too late, you're infected. Yeah. Fuck. Uh, when I shot- that, the blood that I first saw was when I shot him. Not when I got hit. Too late now. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's starting. Oh man. Alright, well, let's see where this takes us. Oh, that's cool. I think it's following me. The mannequins are sad. Yeah, they are. They better be sad. I almost made it all the way out. You die. Yeah, I am. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty nasty, huh? Come on, come on. Look, we're almost there. We're almost there, look. look we're almost Still there. Like symbolic. We're, we're almost there. Pretty nice, right? Boy, you are nothing. Just a man with a thing. What? Do you like that ending? Infected ending. Guess what? Game's out. <gasps> it's January 30th. It's been out for six days. Well, in any case, uh, yeah, so that was it for the the trailer. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, we got the ending we wanted. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I, got, I definitely got the one I wanted, so. <laughs> oh, man. All right, well, we'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.